This is the first so, argument we've had in six years. Yeah, yeah, we've been pretty, pretty calm. Mm -hmm. But now we can let it all out. Now it's yeah. <laughs> it's gonna get really personal. <laughs> I think we should be putting um, most of our exploration budget into human space exploration. If the Apollo missions are anything to go by, they were incredibly efficient. Only 12 people walked on the moon and they brought back 380 kilograms of samples from a wide area. They were very, very efficient to a, a very prescribed plan, but they also had the flexibility as well to explore something that caught their eye. And also there's the wonder of being on another world, of bringing that human perspective back to Earth. I wonder if that's a strong enough argument. It's not, it's not fair, see, Tom gets to hear this first, so... Uh... <laughs> well, I think humans are inherently curious creatures, and our curiosity is one of our strengths. But other than that, we're kind of weak. I think we should be investing primarily our space exploration budget into robotic missions, interplanetary missions, maybe one day even interstellar missions. Because robots make fantastic ambassadors. We can send suites of instruments to the outer planets, they can survive for years or decades in space, something no human being can do yet. And ultimately, we're not putting human lives at risk, but we can all share in the results that these missions produce. So I think robots are the true future of space exploration. Also, they're cute. Go back and forth. And, wrong. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you're wrong. <laughs> Would you be willing to make the uh, the journey, giving up months of your life just to be between worlds? Myself personally, no. See, I don't think you'd really stand by it if you're not willing to. Do, <laughs> if you're not willing to do it yourself, <laughs> Carl Sagan, he obviously was a professional astronomer working on missions like Voyager. He genuinely believed that we should be sending more robots to more worlds. I do think he had a, a really good point because at the time, the Motivation to get into space may have been somewhat political. We had the International Space Station in orbit around the Earth, and we've invested already so much time and effort to testing how humans deal with space, and we're trying to build on that foundation. So it seems such a waste to, mm. to let that go. Okay. Okay. Right, right. Hear me out. Yeah. Should we, should we say this? Robots teach us more about the solar system. I can agree with that. But astronauts teach us more about ourselves. <laughs> it's, it's a good, yeah. it's good combo. It's a good combo.